Hey everybody, it's about noon. I'm sitting here eating lunch. Today is Wednesday, which is one of the days that I have the full day dedicated towards designing everything. So far this morning, I have exercised and cleaned out the gutters, but now I'm actually gonna get started on working on Design the Everything. Starting with the Patreon of the month, no, the prototype of the month video, which I was supposed to send out a couple days ago, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna get, but I'm gonna get that edited now. Daddy, can I watch? Yes, you can watch my video. <laughs> now, I would really like to be machining right now and working on my carabiner testing robot, but I'm starting to get product photography back from Adam and it's looking fantastic. So I'm gonna get what I have put in the Kickstarter so that I can submit my Kickstarter for review. Now, you have to do that before launching any Kickstarter. It takes a couple days, but it doesn't like finalize your campaign. You can keep changing it after you've been approved but I wanna have at least some product photography in there before I submit it. Today is rapidly turning into a computer work day. I just finished getting the Kickstarter together and then did some client design work. My next goal is to design the work holding for my little robot. But before I do that, I think I'm gonna get the powder coating process started. Cause it'll take a little bit longer with these bigger pieces cause it'll take longer to heat up and cool down for things like degassing. So I'm gonna do that. Actually slight change of plans. When I originally made this, I intended on just Loctiting in these rods, but I'm not thrilled with the, the fit and I want it to be take apartable. So I'm going to drill and tap some holes in this and put some set screws in, just like I did on this carriage bar. Though I did that off camera, so, but I'll do it on camera this time. Now that I'm looking at these, they are actually almost exactly the same except for the thickness. So I think I can use my same setup and my same code and it should work fine. The holes won't be centered on the bigger one, but that's fine because the, the mounting holes don't go through all the way anyway. This is kind of a scary part, but I think it's ready to go. Gosh, that went so quickly. It was actually kind of stressful to record and try to watch it at the same time. It was like, I haven't done, I haven't done a lot of this type of machining, so I can't really predict how the machine's gonna act. Uh, but it went, it went fine. The part was done in like five minutes. I would make some speeds and feeds changes, especially on that 3 8 inch end mill, maybe switch to a quarter inch for the bulk of the material removal. But otherwise, it's great. Now I just need to bam saw off this extra stock flip it over and deck off this little hat in the mill. I'm starting to wear down, but I'm gonna do some powder coating.
first two parts are in the oven. They'll be ready in about 17 minutes. I cannot wait to see what this looks like when everything is done and together. If you would like to buy something that I make that is not a robot, you can find it on designtheeverything.com. Thank you, and I'll see you next time.